Yeah, so I don't know what what's that all what that is all about here. Maybe they feel like they've got good enough late game uh, to just keep dominating their opponents and uh, and just win it uh, when they win it, so to speak. I mean, win it when they finally get a, a team fight next to the enemy base and that allows them to push the towers. Something like that. They're, they're thinking, I suppose. Uh, Gwinsu, Skadi on that queen. She hasn't got any special boots yet. Um, I suppose back then there were no uh, face boots. There were only uh, boots of travel or power treads, I suppose. So I don't know whether. Uh, I, I think it was like back then. You then you would either get boots of travel or just normal boots unless you were a carry hero. And carry heroes would get the power treads or the uh, the, the boots of travel. It was only like heroes like, I don't know, Spectre maybe, and Ricky, stuff like that. Really, uh, uh, I don't know, heroes that needed attack. Oh, of course, there was no uh, um, stat bo bonus on the power treads back then either. Sven going down here. A lot of kills again to to meet the Mega Surf, not calling exactly what's going on. Um, Shadow Fiend going down as well. And this I think this is pretty much over. I mean, meet your makers gonna be pushing now three heroes dead for TT and I don't really see what uh, what they can do I mean they video th maker should be able to get a tower here really easily mid Sanking coming in with his ultimate though ultimate going off from the lean as well egg is going down there Sanking able to deal quite some damage here actually but he's gonna go down now himself unfortunately although that um, Sandstorm storm obviously helping out quite a bit trying to escape not gonna help he's gonna go down after a little bit of a stun Dean able to escape though and trying to run heal up here which is gonna be successful tower goes down as you can see Rex is now in huge trouble ultimate going off from the uh, Furion here one Rex goes down and ultimate going off on the Lina. Ah, this is not good. She's gonna go down for sure here. Let's see. Uh, Sven gonna be out in a few seconds here. Warlock gonna be out in a few seconds as well. But they're gonna lose this Rex as well. Probably. Oh, and they might lose Rex is down then as well. Yeah. GG from TT. <laughs> GG from TT. Well, that's pretty much it. Interesting game. Was a little bit one-sided, I have to say. I mean, G uh, TT did um, attempt a comeback, I suppose. Um, didn't really work out for them and uh, yeah they they ended up getting dominated pretty much but uh, well played by media makers and some interesting stuff in this game for sure with the uh, beastmaster forest stuff like that definitely uh, putting up the pressure doing a good job farming a lot and uh, yeah in general just doing good so uh, hope you guys liked the game and the cast and let me know whether you think it's cool to do commentaries on old school games like this. I know this maybe wasn't the most interesting game, uh, but I hadn't watched the game myself beforehand, so I couldn't really know whether it was super good or not, and I suppose it was decent at least. Uh, actually, I, w I would have liked to, uh, to watch a uh, Spectre, Fury and Zeus lineup. I think that was TT who invented that lineup back in the days called the Global Strat. But uh, this was the replay that I found, so I just went for this one. Um, but if you guys liked the game and liked the idea of uh, looking at older versions, I mean, I could even do a commentary at a really old version if I can, if I can find something like, like really, really old school. I don't know. I mean, back before I started playing myself, maybe even. But uh, I don't know. I mean, uh, it's up to you guys. Uh, whatever you prefer. So um, let me know whether you like it, whether you want to see something more like this, or whether you just want to see normal games, or, uh, or well, if there's anything uh, else that might be interesting, just go ahead and let me know. So definitely uh, like to hear you guys' feedback, and uh, hope to see you guys again for some other audios on YouTube, or maybe even some live commentaries. There's some good stuff coming up. There's actually gonna be a game tonight between Tribal Int and Blight Int Farm Fame 2, but uh, you probably won't listen to this audio commentary on YouTube before that. So uh, anyway, should be some good stuff coming up and I've got a lot of free time now. Just finished one exam today 
um, and I've got one exam left um, and that's pretty much all I have to do the rest of this month so that's good I'll, I'm gonna start uh, back for the next semester at university uh, this February so looking forward oh not really looking forward to that I suppose I like having free time but I think it's gonna be a cool semester gonna write a bachelor project try actually gonna try to make a computer game in that bachelor project so that should be interesting but uh, I don't know looking forward to to um, some more Dota action with you guys I uh, hope you guys like it and uh, see you guys sometime soon hopefully